7, 2, 10, senior. And Curtis Watkins, 6, 5, 190, junior. Corzine, 6, 11 in the middle in the backcourt. Gary Garland, 6'4", 180 to junior. Randy Ramsey to 6'1", senior. We're ready to start. And Red Rush, it is yours for the first half. All right, and Bob Wartman ready to throw that spear in the air. Flowers and Corzine. The tip goes over to Dave Batten of the Fighting Irish in Notre Dame. Interesting that the Blue Demon, Dave Corzine, went up trying to get it with the left hand. Batten, right hand side to Duck Williams. The Blue Demon's in the 2-3 zone. Out to Batten, top of the circle, left side to Branning. Branning looks low, gets it into Flowers, puts it off to Williams' right side, starts to shoot, pulls up, and Gary Garland is on him. Back out to Batten, top of the circle, left side to Branning. Branning looking. Passing to the top of the circle, inside, Flowers trying to go on Corzine, almost took a travel, Branning has the ball, Batten. Batten, left-hand side, over to Branning. Rich Branning from Huntington Beach, California, right side, Duck Williams, looks low. Gives it to Kelly Trapuca. Trapuca back to the duck. Don Duck Williams from our nation's capital. Branning left side, 22-footer. Got it. Branning got the first bucket of the ball game. Very deliberate, Red. We went 50 seconds there without a shot before he canned it. Gary Garland going up against the man-to-man -man defense. Down to Ponsetto. Out to Watkins. Into Corzine. Turns around. He puts the ball up and Flowers committed a foul. They will foul a lot inside against Corzine. The bounce into Watkins. Puts it up. Got it. Watkins got inside Kelly Trapuca and tied it up. It's 2-2. Two to 18.50 two, to go on the WGN scoreboard. Branding on the left side against that 2-3 zone. The bat on top of the circle. Right side to Williams. Williams looking, passing back to Batten. Inside, Flowers goes in on Corzine, puts it up off, no good, and a foul is going to be called on Dave Corzine as Flowers went right in and drove into Dave Corzine. Bruce Flowers, the junior, 6'8", 210-pounder from Huntington Woods, Michigan, has another, and it's 4-2 to two, the Fighting Irish lead. Here comes Gary Garland against that press up to Ramsey. Ramsey down the left side, Branning picks him up. Down low it goes to Ponsetto. Turn around, fadeaway 12-footer, got it. Ponsetto tickled the twine for the very first time, and it's tied 4-4. Four to four. 12. Well, let's see what happens now as Branning brings it up to Don Williams, down to Kelly Trapuca. Trapuca back to Don, top of the circle, batting left-hand side to Branning. Branning in the corner to Kelly. Kelly Trapuca back out to Branning on the left-hand side. Passing down low, ball slapped away, but Kelly Trapuca comes up with it. That 2-3 tight zone. Left-hand side, Branning looks inside. He needs some help. Passes in the corner. Kelly, a 22-footer on the way. High up off. No good. Goes behind the backboard. And the Blue Demons have the ball. Here comes Gary Garland, a 6-4 junior from East Orange, New Jersey. To Ponsetto, top of the circle. Right side to Garland. Gets it back, has it knocked away. Trapuca comes up with the ball to Branning. One turnover for each team. Don Williams, the duck, 6'3", senior. Right-hand side, it goes to Branning. Branning jumps 17 feet away on the air. No good, and a foul called on Gary Garland. 17.32 to go on the WGN scoreboard. Rich again puts it up. He's got it, nothing but net again. And it's 6-4. to four. Ponsetto triggers it in to Gary Garland. They try to trap him up. It comes to Ramsey. Duck picks him up. Down low to to uh, Watkins and fouling Corzine from behind is Flowers. Flowers, Red, a tremendous competitor. They go in a 2-1-2 zone. Watkins down to the baseline, out to Gary Garland. To Ponsetto. Ponsetto looking low. Gives it back out to Ramsey. Rolls to the right side. Garland, he fakes. He jumps in the air. A 17-footer. Swisheroo! And there's two. 6-6 six to, six to score. Blue Demons in the Fighting Irish, 17.04 to go. Quick thing about Flowers, he gets into foul trouble. That's been his history. In 615 minutes of playing time this year, 82 personals, and he fouled out of six ball games, including the last of ball game. Batten, right-hand side to the duck. Don Williams, down low to Flowers, back to Don. He jumps in the air, 20-footer, got it. So the duck makes it 8-6, to six, the Irish lead again. Here comes Ramsey against Rich Branning. Ramsey over the 10-second timeline. Gives it over to Gary Garland. Right-hand side to Ponsetto. Ponsetto picked up by Batten. Out to Watkins. Over to Ramsey. Left side, Garland. 22-footer. Swisheroo! And there is another two to tie it. A-all. 
Let's hope Garland's going to have the kind of day that he had at South Bend. If he does, the Irish will be hurting. They're going to really have to rely on Gary's outside shooting today. All right, Rich Branning looking low, passes high. Over it goes this time to Williams, from Batten to Williams. Back out to Batten. Left-hand side, Williams, 21 feet away. Got it, and Williams with his second bucket of the afternoon. And the Irish lead by two again, 10-8. to 8. 16.01 to go on the WGN scoreboard. Here comes Gary Garland, down low to Corzine. They cut off of him to Ponsetto. Ponsetto goes the baseline, an 18-footer off, no good. Actually about a 12-footer, not an 18-footer. Rebounded by Kelly Trapuca. Branding brings the ball up on the right-hand side to Batten. Batten back to Rich Branding from Huntington Beach, California to Batten. Left-hand side, Duck Williams fakes. Goes in the air, 15-footer on the way off, no good. And Ramsey comes down with the ball. Randy Ramsey has the ball. Down the right side in the corner to Watkins. Watkins picked up by Trapuca. Out it goes to Gary Garland. Garland over to Ramsey. Down low to Corzine on the left-hand side of the bucket. Corzine goes in, hooks it up, got it. And big Dave Corzine asserts his power to tie it 10 to 10. And that right now is the fifth time this ball game has been tied already. 10 to 10, 15, 10 to go. Duck looks back at Digger to see what he should do. A 1-2-2 two, two zone now. The Blue Demon set up in a 1-2-2. Two, two. Out it goes to Duck again. Duck over to Branning, comes between the circle. They're going to set up a play. Inside to Kelly, jumps up, puts a shot up off, no good. And going up is Ponsetto for the board. Here comes Ramsey, down to Watkins, goes to the baseline, backs up, almost double dribble, goes out to Ramsey. Ramsey back to Watkins, left side. Gives it out to Ponsetto. Ponsetto looks low and drives down to the baseline, turns around. He needs a little help as Batten's on him. Now he drives the baseline, turns around, hooks it up. Got it, Ponsetto with a beauty. A right-handed swinging hook shot to put the Blue Demons in front 12 to 10. The Great. first time Great. the Blue Demons have been in front. 14-21 to go. Branning looking low, passing out to Flowers. Flowers back to Branning, left side. Inside for Puke in the corner. Duck Williams shoots, and it's in and out. No good. The ball taken by Ramsey. Here comes a two-on-one. Ponsetto right side goes in, lays it up. Beautiful shot. Six points for Ponsetto. And it's a four-point demon lead, 14-10. 14, 14 minutes to go. A 1-2-2 two, two zone once again. The ball comes to Flowers, out to Branning. Branding looks inside, passes back to Flowers, top of the circle into Trapuca. He puts a shot up and is rolling off with the ball taken by Joe Ponsetto, and Trapuca comes down on his back. Full court presses on. Ramsey brings it in against Branding. Tracy Jackson has gone into the ball game. Jackson is in at one forward spot. Into Corzina goes left hand side. Ponsetto jumps. He shoots up off. No good. And Garland has the ball, puts it back up, rolls around, got it. Gary Garland is third bucket, and it's the biggest lead, 16 to 10. 13.25 to go on the WGN scoreboard as Rich Branding comes to the top of the circle. Right-hand side, Tracy Jackson, 1-2-2 zone. Two, two Left side, it goes to Branding. Inside to Flowers, turn around, eight-footer, got it. Flowers with his fourth point, makes it a four-point differential. Ramsey against Branding, 16 to 12, Blue Demons. Down to Ponsetto. Ponsetto picked up by Batten. Out it goes to Garland. Right side, Ramsey, 17 feet away. Swisheroo, and Ramsey with two. And the Blue Demons all have scored in this game this afternoon. They're 18 collapsing. to 12. They're collapsing on Corzine, and so far the perimeter shooting for the Demons is there. If this keeps up, they're going to really be tough to reckon with. And now they've got to keep the Irish off of the offensive board. And the Blue Demons have got to go to that defensive board a little better. All right, Branning, right-hand side to Batten. Batten out to Branning, top of the circle. Branning looks around, gives it to Lambeer, back out to Duck on the left-hand side. The Blue Demons in a 2-1-2, two, two, or almost a 2-3. Branning, top of the circle, Batten, left side, Duck Williams, bounces down to Puka, 10-footer, off, no good. The ball slapped out, taken by Garland. Up to Bradshaw. Bradshaw on the left side. He jumps a 15-footer, off the iron, no good, and taken by Rich Branning off of the backboard, the 12th rebound. That's the 12th rebound for the Fighting Irish against 15 for the Blue Demons. Branning, out to Batten. Batten, left-hand side to Duck Williams to Batten. Top of the circle, right side, Branning. Rich Branning from Huntington Beach, California. Gives it to Kelly Trapuca. Way out to Batten, 19 feet away. Swish by Dave Batten's first deuce of the night. And it's down to a four-point lead. Eight points, the biggest lead with 640, 29-21. Now with 407, it's a four-point lead. 
Right-hand side, Bradshaw to Garland. He jumps an eight-footer, turn around up, off, no good, and the foul called on Curtis Watkins. Randy Ramsey comes back in, and Bradshaw goes out. Here comes Rich Branning. Branning against that 2-3 zone. Gives it out to Batten, into Lambeer, turns around, jumps, puts it up, rolls in. Lambeer with his fourth point, and that makes it a two-point lead with 3.41 to go. First half. Top of the key goes to Ponsetto. Over to Gary Garland, down low to Corzine. He puts a hook up, got it. Just get it into Dave and let him take him to the head because he can do it. A four-point Blue Demon lead. 31-27 as Rich Branning brings it up against that zone. Out to Batten, right side to the Duck. Duck Williams into Lambeer. Turns around left side, Branning fakes right, goes left. The six-footer banked in beautifully by Rich Branning, his eighth point. And down to a two-point Blue Demon lead again. Here comes Ramsey against Branning. Randy Ramsey from Thornton High School in Harvey. To Watkins, back down to Garland, and the ball goes out of bounds. Tried the give and go, and it went out of bounds that time. Guns 10,110. Branding bounces into Lambeer, down to Kelly, goes in and ties it up. Kelly Trapuca with his second bucket ties it. 31-31, 2.46 to left in the ball game now. It goes down to Watkins. Watkins to Ponsetto. Passing over to Corzine. Corzine gives it back out to Ramsey. The Blue Demons have to get something in that bucket now. Ponsetto looking low. Bounces down to Corzine. Turn around. Jump shot is up. Roll in and out. No good. And he is fouled by Bill Lambeer. With an 82% from the charity stripe. Five points for Big Dave. It is good again, six points for Dave. He is 12 for 12 from the line here at Lawrence. 33-31 with 2.20 to go as Branding is over the timeline. The Blue Demons fall back into a 1-2-2. They're using a double post. Right side it goes to Batten, low. Out it goes to Branding. The double post is Lambeer on the left side, and on the right side, Trapuca. It goes out to Williams. Branding over to Trapuca. Inside Lambeer, right side bat, an 18-footer baseline off, no good, and Ramsey comes down with the ball. 33-31, to 31, the Blue Demons lead by two with 155. Ponsetto out to Watkins. Watkins over to Ramsey. Gives it to Gary Garland. Down low to, to Ponsetto, and Batten almost had his arm off of him, and it's up, off, no good. Ponsetto has it, puts it up, off, no good. And going in, Lambeer comes up with the ball. We're going to have a foul called on Watkins. Puts it up, in and out, no good. And Corzine gets the ball, and he is hacked from behind by Bill Hanslick. Corzine, the big guy, six points, two for two from the line. It is up, and he finally missed the 13th free throw try here at Lawrence. His 13th free throw try was missed. 33-31, 1.27 to go now. Right side, Hanslick. Hanslick. Inside, Lambeer jumps, eight-footer, got it, and it's tied again. Lambeer getting his sixth point. The press is on, into Garland. Garland back to Ponsetto. Ponsetto bringing the ball up, back over to Garland, throws the ball out of bounds. The turnover for the sixth time for the Blue Demons. The ball comes into Rich Branding, the 1-2-2 zone. They have a double high post. Right side to Hanslick. Hanslick looking inside. He puts a 20-footer up, got it. Hanslick with his second bucket, the Irish lead. The ball comes into Ramsey. Ramsey up to Ponsetto, right side to Corzine, jumps, 13-footer, in and out, no good, and Ponsetto didn't go to the board. And now the Irish could lead by four if they convert here. Here comes Branning, 40 seconds left to go. Branning to a high post, Lambeer back to Rich Branning, right-hand side to Stan Wilcox. Back to Branding, top of the circle. Into Lambeer, in the corner, Hanslick took steps, no call, and three seconds in the lane, finally called on Lambeer. Four turnovers for Notre Dame, six for DePaul. Ramsey against the press, back down to Ponsetto. Ponsetto looking, bouncing in, and the ball goes out of bounds. Well, they'll go for one shot. The Irish have a two-point lead. The Blue Demons have blown an eight-point lead, but you have to give the Irish a lot of credit the way they've come back. Hanslick over to Branning in the corner. Wilcox shoots off the iron. Trapuca tips it in. Nobody boxed them out. Trapuca 
got his third bucket and the Irish lead 37 to 33 at halftime. We'll be back right after this short timeout. Twenty minutes to go. In twenty minutes, we'll know. Somebody goes to St. Louis to the finals. Somebody goes home. We're ready to jump it up and stay with us. Notre Dame leads it by four. It's tipped in the air. It is controlled by Notre Dame. Kelly Trapuca gives off to Branning as they move from right to left. Branning goes down to the right side. High lob underneath. Turnaround jumper, Trapuca tried to bank it in, no good. Lambert went up, couldn't get it down, and the ball belongs to DePaul. Curtis Watkins came off the board with it. They get it up to Randy Ramsey, the outlet man on the left side. Branning is on him, bounce pass to Ponsetto, now out to Garland, fakes a jumper, goes cross court to Ramsey. Ramsey being guarded by Branning, bounce pass, Ponsetto right side, Trapuca's on him, they're in a tight man to man. Ponsetto right side, lob to Corzine. Corzine wants to go up, does go up, shot is blocked. It was blocked by Lambert, and the Irish have it. Here comes Duck Williams over Ramsey, put it up, got it down. Duck Williams over Ramsey as they manage the fast break. And Notre Dame draws first blood in the second half on the bucket by Duck. 39-33 for Williams, six points. Here's Garland, fakes the jumper top of the key into Corzine right side of Curtis Watkins, baseline jumper, around the rim and out, no good. Trapuca gets the boards. Branning up the middle. They had a three-on-three. Three. Now they slow it down. Work it in the middle to Trapuca. Foul is called underneath. That's number three, by the way, on Watkins. Branning inbounds. Ponsetto bats it out of bounds. Tried to bounce it off of Duck Williams. Branning slaps leather. Holds it high. Lobs into Lambeer. He goes to Hanslick. They send it out to the point man at the top. That's Duck Williams. Motions Branning over. Now they reverse and Branning is out high. They're spreading to fall out. Trying to spread them out wide to get the cutters working effectively. Here's Branning. Bounce pass Hanslick. Hanslick double team gives off to Duck Williams who goes left. Now dribbles back out. Goes to Hanslick. Over to Branning. Jumper 18 footer. No good. Tip up. No good by Trapuca. They battle for it. Ramsey comes up with it. Wheels it up to Ponsetto. Ponsetto off to Garland. Gary scoop shot. It is no good. Tip up attempt. No good. Garland again got it. Gary Garland. Third effort. If at first you don't succeed, try again. If that doesn't work, go again. And the third timer on it went through, and Garland has a dozen points. And the Demons are back within forward, 39-35. Lambert goes to the line, shoots 67% from there, the sophomore from Toledo. He's hit on two of three so far today. That free throw is good. He could go up by five. They do not. It's missed. Tip-up attempt by Tech. Kelly Trapuca, no good, and Corzine got the board. 52-48. The Demons with the ball. Clyde Bradshaw back in now for DePaul. Goes to Ponsetto right side. Into Watkins' turnaround jumper. Curtis got it. Curtis Watkins midway in the key with a turnaround jumper. Brings DePaul to within two. It's 52-50. Here's Branning. Guarded by Garland. Gets it to Batten. Over to Lambeer. Lambeer out high to Batten. Looks for a cutter. Goes to Jackson instead. Perimeter man top. Lambeer shot good. They got Lambeer on the right side. They let him alone for just a moment and he banged it in. Nine points for him. 54-50 Notre Dame. Bradshaw right side to Ponsetto. Comes back to Curtis Watkins. 15 foot jumper good. Curtis Watkins with a hot hand. That's two for two from basically the same spot. And again, the Demons pull within two, 54-52. Here's Branning coming up the left side. Goes to Kelly Trapuca. He penetrates, puts up a shot. Got it. Kelly Trapuca penetrating. Went up and banked it in from the left side. Eight points for him in the second half, 14 on the ball game, and he has led the offensive charge for Notre Dame. 56-52 in favor of the Irish. Into Corzine, high lob, goes up for the shot, left baseline, no good. Lambeer can't get it. Ponsetto took it away from Lambeer and banked it in. Joe Ponsetto, eight points. Got it away from Lambeer and got it down. 56-54, the Irish by two. And the Blue Demons finally got an offensive board. Now how about the defensive board? Trapuca, jumper, right side, got it again. Kelly Trapuca's radar personified. He has hit. 
five buckets in the second half, has 16 points, and it's 58-54. The Irish again by four. Curtis Watkins right side, trip is on him. Over to Garland. Gary trying to get a pick, does get a pick from Ponsetto, but can't use it. Gives out to Bradshaw. Bradshaw tied up almost, comes back to Garland. Now back to Clyde Bradshaw. He works left side, trying to drive on Branning, dumps off Ponsetto. Out to Bradshaw, to Garland right side, to Corzine. Wants to try the turnaround over Lambeer. Does not go up, fires back out to Garland. It almost goes astray, and it's saved by Bradshaw. Here's Ponsetto, driving. Dumps off to Corzine, a foul is called. It's gonna go against Kelly Krapuka. Ponsetto is driving the baseline. Garland will inbound as Notre Dame tries to box out, gets it to Dice, turnaround jumper, baseline no good, off the front of the rim. Batten has it, inbounds to Tracy. Tracy comes up the middle and Jackson puts it in. Tracy Jackson got the outlet pass from Batten and broke it right up the middle. 58-54. And a foul was called as he went in for the bucket. Make it 60-54 with 6.54 to go. With the three-point play. 61-54. The Demons are going to have to come back. Here comes Bradshaw. Passes out to Garland as he's in heavy traffic. Lob to Bradshaw, right baseline into Corzine. Corzine wants to work, wants to wheel and deal and go over Lambeer camp. They got him boxed out, out to Bradshaw. Jumper, no good. Tip up attempt, no good. Second tip attempt, no good. And finally, it is Bill Lambeer who clears, gets it up to Duck, and the Duck puts it in. They managed to fast break it. Lambeer up to Duck Williams. And Notre Dame all of a sudden starting to pull away. Timeout, DePaul, they want to regroup with 6.21 to go in the score. Notre Dame, 63, DePaul, 54. Side, works it into Curtis Watkins, almost lost it, gets it to Garland, right side jumper, in and out, no good. And the lid's on the bucket all of a sudden for DePaul. The rebound cleared by Batten. Notre Dame brings it up. Rich Branning with the ball. Goes right side to Kelly Trapuca, who's had the hot hand of the second half. Lambeer back to Trapuca. Starts to drive on Garland. Thinks better of it. Bounces back out. Top of the key to Branning. Pull up jumper 15 foot. Good. Rich Branning canned it from 15 feet away. Right at the free throw stripe. And Notre Dame pulling away now by 11. 65-54. Ramsey bounce pass, Watkins right side, back to Ramsey. He's picked up by Duck Williams, back to Curtis Watkins, Krapuka's on him, Ramsey with a jumper, top of the key, no good off the front of the rim. Curtis Watkins rebound, turnaround jump, it is no good. And Branning clears the board. Nothing will go down for DePaul, absolutely zip. Five and a half minutes to go in the ball game. Branning, top of the key, bounces right side to Lambeer, over to Krapuka at the baseline. Corzine comes out on him. Trip drives, puts it up over Corzine. It rolled around the rim and out. Follow-up shot, though, is good by Lambeer. Lambeer got the follow-up off the miss by Trapuca. 36 boards for the Irish to 33 for the Blue Demons. And they're getting the offensive board, and that's where you win it. Curtis Watkins, jumper midway in the key. That one finally went through. But it was an indecisive bucket of that. It rolled around a little bit before it went home. The press is on. The Irish track it. They get it to Batten. He's got a three-on-one situation to Trapuca. He got it. They had a three-on-one situation. Lambert was there. Trapuca was there. Batten went right side to Trapuca, and he dumped it in easily. 69-56, 13-point votes for the Irish. 4.40 to go in the ballgame. Bradshaw lob into Corzine. Corzine went up for the shot. It will not count. The foul is going to be assessed against Bill Lambeer. And he's in the one-on-one -on -one situation right here. His free throw is good. He'll get the other. 16 points for Dave Corzini. Second free throw on its way. It is also good. That makes it 69-58. And the press is going to be on the Irish. Break out of the eye. Branning has it. Gives back to Batten. Batten to Lambeer near the timeline. High lob Kelly Trapuca. Didn't want to go to Duck Williams down near the baseline, even though the Duck called for the ball. They bring it back out to Branning and to Duck Williams' right side over to Trapuca down near the baseline. Garland is on him. Now Tripp's going to bring it out to Lambeer. Lambeer out high. The Irish in no hurry. They control the lead. 11-point lead at that. Duck Williams wants to go around. Curtis Watkins in travel. Here's Glad Bradshaw left side to Gary Garland. Jumper 20 feet away. It is no good. Trapuca got the board away from Curtis Watkins. Boy, I'll tell you, this freshman, Kelly Trapuca, is worth his weight in gold to the Irish. Tremendous athlete. Here's Lambeer to Batten. The cutter in the lane. No good. Follow-up by Batten. No good. We are going to get a foul underneath, though. He had 18 the last time he faced DePaul. He fouled out in that ball game. 
with four minutes to go in the overtime. Second free throw right here on its way. Got that one. He's four for four at the stripe. Has a total of six points. And the Irish lead at 71-58. Here's Ramsey to Garland. Garland trying to drive the left baseline. Comes back out to Ramsey. Over to Curtis Watkins. Shovels it to Bradshaw. Right baseline. Left hand push. No good. And going high for the board. Guess who? Kelly Trapuca. He's done everything but sell popcorn in this place this afternoon. Kelly Trapuca getting the ball for the Irish. Here's Branding up the left side. Ramsey's on him in a one-on-one -on -one situation. Out to Lambeer. Point man at the top. Corzine comes out high to meet him. To Trapuca. Left side. Garland picks him up. He dumps off to Batten. Batten underneath to Trapuca on a give and go. No good. Tip up attempt. No good. Second attempt. No good. They still scramble. Finally, Corzine comes down, hits the outlet man. Garland bounce pass. Bradshaw right side puts it up. Got it. Nice move by Clyde Bradshaw to get the bucket. Six points for him. Back to an 11 point deficit for DePaul. 71 to 60. Three minutes to go in the ball game. Here's Lambeer. Over to Batten, left baseline. Watkins out on him to Trapuca. Didn't go to the cutter. Duck Williams left of the lane. Comes back instead to Batten. Now out high to Lambert. They are in no hurry, whatever. Notre Dame trying to go to St. Louis in the finals. DePaul trying to prevent it. Here's Batten, right side. Off to Lambeer. Holds it high at the baseline. Ball stolen away by Gary Garland. Gary Garland going in, lays it in as he took it away from Batten. 16 points for Gary Garland, 71-62. The Demons trailed by 9, 2.20 to go. Duck Williams in the forecourt, dribbles back out now as they want to set it up. Don't forget the last time they met the Irish, led by five with a minute and a half to go, and DePaul won it. They work it underneath to Duck Williams, and Duck got it in. The camera fell over. Second free throw by Lambeer. It is no good. He misses that one. Here's a steal by Branning. Goes in. Got it. The entire starting unit going out now. Batten going out. Branning would be out of there too, except he's at the line for a free throw as he was fouled and goes to the line for the three-point play. And he got it. Up to Woolridge. Woolridge goes out of bounds with the basketball as he couldn't control the fast break, but it doesn't matter. The gun goes off. That is it. A big victory for Notre Dame as they will now go on to St. Louis and be one of the final four. The final score here, Notre Dame 84 and DePaul 64. Bill Berg and Red Rush back at the Allen Fieldhouse, and here's how the individual scoring breaks down for the fighting Irish of Notre Dame, Kelly Trapuca with 18 points. He was on the boards all day. For my money, the most valuable player in this ballgame. Trapuca, the freshman, with 18. Brenning had 15. Batten had 7. Flowers had 7. Duck Williams, a fine outing for the Duck. Danny Duck Williams with 14 points. Bill Lambeer had a dozen. Tracy Jackson had 5. Bill Hanslick had 4. And Jeff Carpenter in the closing seconds of play canned a bucket for 2, a total of 84. For the DePaul Blue Demons, Dave Corzine had 17, Garland had 18, Ponsetto and Watkins each had eight, Clyde Bradshaw had six, Bill Dice had five, Ramsey had two for a total of 64. So the Fighting Irish coming back strong in the second half to avenge an earlier defeat this season at the hands of the Blue Demons in South Bend. Notre Dame now goes on to the Final Four in St. Louis. And for my money, Red, if they play basketball in St. Louis the way they played here, Kentucky or no Kentucky, Duke or no Duke, I think that this ball club from South Bend has to be looked upon as one to reckon with.